Hi. Um, in my experience, the number one way that organizations and companies can use content uh, is by making it relevant to their consumer. So if you could make it topical, if you could make it based on location, it could, if you could make it based on gender, so get as specific as possible with regards to your customer's profile. If it is relevant to your customer, he will love that content. So that's the way that you use content marketing to appeal to your customers. Make it as relevant and topical as possible. Uh, now, having relevant content is not the only thing that you need to keep in mind. You also need to remind yourself that consumers or customers only skim and scan content. When a consumer picks up his newspaper, he doesn't go through each and every word. He just skims and scans through the headlines. So your content, while being relevant, also needs to be extremely be extremely skimmable and scannable, right? So you need to have paragraphs, you need to have titles and subtitles and so on. Having a two or three hour video or even a one hour video would probably not appeal to your customer in spite of it being relevant to him. You should target short videos maximum three or four minutes that are extremely relevant to the customer. The shorter and crisper you make your content, especially for videos, the better it will appeal to your customers. So increasingly what I've observed is IT services companies are getting more digital, especially into digital marketing. And this is of importance because any customer that is going to buy a service from you is definitely going to Google your name, do research about your company, do research about the services that you offer, even before he meets with you. Your company, your employees, your CEO, your services, your client case studies, all will be googled before a customer sits on the table to talk to you. Hence, if you're an ID services company, having a comprehensive digital services strategy is extremely crucial. Because this is a business where people look at client testimonials, they look at references, they look at any kind of information that they can find about you. So typically an IT services uh, organization can use social media in two ways. You can use it for supply, where you are trying to uh, attract potential employees. And for, for, such, for such kind of a scenario, Facebook would be the ideal platform, right? A lot of your employees or a lot of your potential hires are likely to be Facebook. So a lot of Facebook marketing and advertising would help a lot. You can also look at the demand side and that's where social media tools like LinkedIn play a very important role. So you need to have your company page updated, update all, all, all of your services, get a few customer testimonials on LinkedIn. From a demand point of view, I would say that in my experience, LinkedIn is the number one tool. So if you're an IT uh, for sales, it's the number one tool for sales. So if you're an IT services company uh, using LinkedIn and other professional networking uh, websites would take you a long way. It will hold you in good stead with, rega with regard to your demand generation plans.